What's so wrong that it became right? What's something that so many people got wrong that eventually, the incorrect version became accepted by the general public? The thing you wear on your torso to prevent cooking splatter from ruining your clothes was an apron. Eventually an apron became an apron and we just all accepted it. Nimrod was actually, like a great mythical hunter or something. But after Bugs Bunny called Elmer Fudd Nimrod, it was changed to mean foolish. Peruse by definition is to carefully read over something, it's been so overused that it now means the exact opposite to just skim through things. People used to say God be with you when they were leaving but over time it slowly morphed into goodbye and now that's just the norm. Apparently. Using POV incorrectly in TikTok saw memes. Hot water heater and ATM machine. Luke, I am your father. Cleaning your ears with Q-tips. Should of. Irregardless. Fucking hate that word. Garlic aioli. It's redundant to add garlic after saying aioli as aioli already means a sauce that is an emulsion of garlic and fat substance oil, mayo, butter. Garlic aioli literally means garlic garlic sauce. I could care less. And it aggravates me every time. Cussing in front of my mom. Literally. The phrase pull yourself up by your bootstraps was intended as a lil tongue in cheek joke because it's literally impossible. And now it's used completely unironically. Figures. Pedants of Reddit, this is your moment. Car dealerships in the United States. They don't need to exist but they do anyway, raising prices for everyone. Decimate meaning to reduce by one in tenth came to mean annihilate meaning reduce to nothing. Alanis Morissette's usage of the word ironic. Using disinterested when they mean uninterested. Not the same thing. Uninterested is the one that means bored disinterested means not influenced by considerations of personal advantage. Pugs. Goldfish having three seconds memory. That ghosting is an acceptable way of separating in most cases. Saying I instead of me. Example this pic is of my husband and I. The actual grammatically correct is this pic is of my husband and me. RPG, rocket propelled grenade, is the accepted common usage, but it's wrong. Rushnoi protivatankovi granatomot, actually means handheld anti-tank grenade launcher. Terms used in therapy settings Therapeutic language being used in everyday life. Everyone is not toxic or a narcissist. Nor should it be a trend to be neurodivergent thanks TikTok. Tipping culture in the US. Tipping. Responsibility for workers to make a livable wage should be on the employer, not the customer. Intents and purposes. Not intensive purposes. Literally now means figuratively. Apparently recently Bin Laden according to Twitter and TikTok. Orient orientate. That people used ten of their brain. Aspiring to be ignorant and uneducated. Refusing to see more than one side of an issue and proud of it. Financial crime. Anarchy means without rulers and it's been used incorrectly for so long that most people think it's synonymous with chaos. Anal. The word literally being used not literally. Now it's so used it's part of the fucking dictionary definition. Lots of linguistics stuff, because that's part of how languages evolve. I could care less is generally accepted even though it's nonsense. Putting an apostrophe before s when it's the last letter of a word and not possessive. The word theory is now used as hypothesis. I would say being gay. And don't slam me because I said it. I don't care if anyone is gay or not it's not my life. I'm just saying overall it has been not accepted and is moving into the being accepted category. Porn. Literally translated from Greek devil's pictures. Companies storing, collecting, selling our personal data. People incorrectly spelling risky as risky. 
athletes being excused from societal repercussions of domestic violence because they're rich. Eating ass. How to drive. For a large and seemingly growing population of the country the US anyway, being racist bigoted ignorant and being proud of it. I remember when snobbery was considered a vice. Now it's seen as a virtue.